My name is Zoe Goldman, and I'm a long-term New Yorker and a uh, cyclist. And I actually got to purchase a tandem bike um, at an auction that Transportation Alternatives held. And because I had this bike, I started riding with friends and partners, and then I, I said, wow, wouldn't it be great to be able to bring cycling, ride with people who would be challenged to ride a bike on their own. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh you okay? <laughs> now I am. <laughs> <laughs> I am uh, Susan Elephant and uh, my husband Artie who recently passed away really loves the biking, the tandem biking and it started off with uh, him trying to get bikes from the city and uh, they did the, the first five borough the bikes came off a truck, uh, no air in the tires. Uh, I'm Harry Farrell. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm uh, colleagues and friends with, with Mark and Adam, who are also here today, and, and Mark, who is kind of uh, involved in putting this together. Um, the, yeah, today was fun. Went out around the park three times, so uh, that was uh, a good uh, mix in my normal normal training. <laughs> Woo! Yay. Yes, that was so much fun. Thank you for letting me be a great first time teacher to me when. Alright, so yes. Now hold on to the bike and we'll get you right back onto the curve. Okay. Woo! My name is Braulio Thorne, and I'm here because I I want to meet a lot of people, ride bikes, and keep myself in shape. Um, being visually impaired, I really think is a good idea to come out here and really partake with with people, meet people, ride bikes, keep healthy, and it's one more thing to do on a Saturday. All right. Thank you. How was it? Oh, so much fun. Pretty good, actually. Yeah. He's such an interesting guy. Oh. <laughs> Tons of interesting well, people around are. these parts. <laughs> well, I need to be nice because we put them on good again. Can you get them all right? <laughs> Hi, my name is Janet Becker. I'm from Milburn, New Jersey, and I came here today uh, by the recommendation of a friend, Tiffany, because I haven't ridden a bike in a non sighted capacity since I've been blind for seven and a half years, so in eight and a half years, and I really miss riding bikes and being out and being in the park and laughing, and so I came here and I had the opportunity to get on a bike with Mark um, Carhartt. And it was such a great experience, I actually feel like crying because it felt so invigorating and fun and I felt so capable. And I'm grateful for this opportunity. I, I think everyone should try it, it's fabulous. Really good. Yeah. I really think it's a good camp for a lot of work. I live in Jersey and I enjoy riding with people. I like the people. My name is Ederi Herrera and I love this program. Uh, I am here because a friend of mine, a New Yorker, uh, informed me of it. And I think this is a great program because it gives the opportunity to uh, visually impaired and blind people to experience what a bike is. And if they never ridden before, it gives them the opportunity to also do the exercise and socialize with other people, which is a very important part for us people visually impaired and I think this is a great program and I would love to attend every Saturday.